you know, as a coach, you are constantly evaluating your player's body language. And you want to try to make it as consistent as possible. When they are fatigued, when they have made a great play, when they have made a really bad play, or a critical game-ending play, you want to be able to have great physical presence. There's often times when players will drop a pass and they'll start hitting themselves in the head and I don't know who they're doing that for. Maybe the audience, maybe their parents, maybe just to, to reflect to their teammates that they've, they've messed up. But what you're doing if you do that is you're constantly conveying to your unconscious mind that you made a poor play. The ability to be consistent in championship type of performances is critical. You know, and as you approach your customers, your clients, you've got to maintain that steady, passionate focus with great physical presence. If you had a client, maybe your biggest client at 10 in the morning dropped you and all of a sudden you have two appointments, one at 1 o'clock and one at 3 o'clock, those next customers don't care that you just lost your big, biggest client. And therefore, you've got to be able to convey with great physical presence, body language, that you are ready to go, ready to serve, and passionate about attending to their needs. That's the message for today. And as always, expect to execute.